Hi you guys, so today's video is going to be um, Barbie DIY Crimp and Curl. Um, so this is her, I bought it from well, Toys R Us, they have a Toys R Us when I went on vacation. Um, there was a Toys R Us down there, they no longer have one by my house, so it's very difficult to find new things because Walmart takes forever to release stuff, so I mean, I get dolls when I can for you guys. So. Um, this is a Barbie DIY crimp and curl. So this is, let me show you the doll. She's beautiful, right? She's got very long hair. She's about 20 something dollars at Toys R Us. She has a crimper, a curling iron, and a brush and some hair ties. And also a squirt bottle because she's water activated. It's, these are the hair ties right here. Um, she is very, very pretty, you guys. Very, very beautiful. Now, you may say, oh, they've released this before. They have, actually. They have released this doll but with rubber legs like maybe a year ago so this is this doll right here they also released this doll too and I did a review on her a long long time ago she is it the exact same thing but without water this was a failed product so they tried to re-release the same thing again maybe this time they add water to it maybe it might hold this was a failed um this was this was um a curling Barbie too, like you, you could just um, wrap the iron around her, and the and the curls would hold right, but they didn't. They actually drop like a second after you would let it go, the curls actually drop. So they have decided to recreate this product using water now. So this is the old one right here, and they have recreated this one. So if you have this one right, it's pretty much the same thing, but you're adding water to it now, and it's probably going to be vinyl. So that's what I would I would imagine. This Barbie has the bend and click knees. Which is very rare to find but um so this is the um mechanism which is almost the exact same thing like you'd curl it and then you'd hold it for 15 seconds and let it go but this one you add water to it now then these are some of the examples on the back right here see and you're supposed to curl it crimp it and you hold it for 15 seconds and you're supposed to be able to brush it out and not have any issues but i find that with this doll right here you wouldn't like as soon as you'd let go it would drop within like three or four seconds it would start on wand and so it it really didn't hold any style so we're going to try out this barbie and see if she's worth that 19 dollars price at toys r us you guys she's very very pretty little mini skirt these are her little wedges right here classic barbie wedges blonde she also has a purple streak in here so we're going to pop this girl out the box and stay tuned Okay, so I just pulled, put the um, water in. It is a pop top. Apparently, I was pulling too hard and it popped off the whole thing. It has got little threads on it and everything like that. So, it is a misting bottle right here. I just filled it up with water. It has a pop top. So, you just kind of snap the cap on and off, which I didn't think was happening because when I pulled it, the whole thing came apart, which I was like, okay, where, where's the squirt bottle? Nope, but it's, it's a pop top. So, stay tuned. So, if you want to see that review for that doll with the sparkly dress that I just showed you, I'll leave the link down in the description below. Um, it was a video from a long time ago, so the video quality may not be as good as, as it is kind of now. Like, it's kind of semi-decent now. But, um, I'll leave that link down below, and you can see how it kind of unwound as soon as I curled it up. So, we're going to give this girl a try right here. So they do come with directions on how to do this, which I thought was strange because, I mean, you just basically just squirt it and you um, curl it. That's about it. There's no actual electricity going to these curling irons. Um, it is not hot in any way. It's just a pretend plastic um, curling iron or crimper. She does come with um, directions on how to crimp and curl the hair. If you're unfamiliar, they do have directions on how to do that. I'm a little bit somewhat familiar. You don't... Um, what I would suggest is not to just dunk the whole head in the water, just lightly mist, mist her with water so that way everything works out. So these are some of her accessories that she comes with right here. This is some hair ties right here, which is rubber bands, which I don't know why they can't include cloth bands, which I would think they would include that kind of accessory because the doll is not meant to last, you know what I'm saying? Because this doll is plastic, her whole body is plastic. There's no rubber bending click knees like the last one. The last one is a little bit better quality than this one, but the last one has an oily, some kind of oily substance in her hair. I don't know what that is. I think that was the curl mechanism. But um, she comes with her little um, crimper right here, 
It's a it's a, just a Barbie pink crimper. It has the waffles in it. Yeah, she got waffles right there. You see them waffles? Ripples and all this stuff like that. Okay. And this is a Barbie um, doll. Here, mister. Okay. Gotcha. So it just kind of unscrews like that, like that. And there's no top that pops off. I thought the top popped off, but it didn't apparently. Um, she comes with a curling on. As once again, I said, is no electricity. It's a pretend play curling on. We're gonna see how long these curls last. Hopefully, it'll last a little bit longer. It's a doll brush right there. Very strange looking um, Barbie doll brush. What does that say on the back? Oh, it just says Barbie. Okay. And this is the doll. I'll give you a good close-up view of her before I start curling her hair and things like that. So this is a doll. I mean, she is pretty, okay? I'll give her that. She is pretty. She's plastic. So I just miss the old Barbies. That's why I love my Totally Hair Barbie. I bought the reproduction. She is awesome and epic. But she's still pretty. You know, I do love her a lot. I love all the Barbies that I buy. I do like them. So I don't buy them just to you know, review and return. I buy them to keep and collect. So I have her here. Even the ones that I do the curling reviews like that, I still put them on my shelf. But she's got like little rhinestones and like, what is this? I don't even know what this is. It's like nylon and this is, and both top and bottom is nylon. Um, she does have an elastic waistband for the dress. And the um, top right here is all Velcro right here. This is Velcro, hopefully you can see that. Why is this camera not focusing? Um, she's got just really cool, like pink, purpley streaks in the hair. Only two. Um, she's got some kind of gel substance right here, which is kind of like why I don't know why, but she does. Kind of sad. And she's got like really 1990s like wedges. Seriously, 90s hooker chic wedges. Seriously. But they're still cute. I mean, they're a little high, but they're cute, you know. Her body is on the hollow side. It is a little bit generic-y feeling. It is very hollow. I could just put it that way. It's hollow. She's got the fashionings to pose with the bent arm and one straight. And one that's bent. Just want you guys to pay attention to that. Um, she is very pretty, but she is very hollow. I will give her that. Um, I kind of wish that they would have made her a little bit more of a durable body. I guess because they're giving her hair, so they're giving and taking almost kind of thing. Like, okay, you get longer hair, but we're going to give you a thinner body kind of thing, which I think is ridiculous. I think they do that to save money. They'll give you a Barbie body. It's not going to break or anything, but they're giving you a lighter plastic body, but they're giving you longer hair kind of thing. I'm probably never going to get sponsored by Mattel, but I like to give you guys my honest review on things. I want you guys to spend good money on good quality products. She's okay. She's not going to break or anything like that. So I'm going to fill up this water bottle and we're going to get to curl it, so stay tuned. Okay, so I'm going to try my best to curl this hair off camera. Um, uh, okay, so we have a little section of Barbie's hair right here. This is going to be, I would recommend you take really small sections. I think if you take really big chunks, it's not going to do anything, basically. That's just my opinion, but you could try it, but I don't think it's going to work. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pop the top off right here, which is the little squirt bottle right here, which is kind of cute, you know, whatever. And you're going to mist it right there. So maybe kind of mist it, make sure it's damp but not soaking wet. And I'm going to try the crimper first, I guess. That would be a good idea. Okay, so we're going to take a little small section like this. We're going to try to crimp the hair. So you're going to do 15 seconds, okay? One, two. So. And you're going to move down. Oh, look, it's working. Okay. So it's 15 seconds each section. You go down 15 seconds. Okay, you guys? Okay. It seems to be working. See the crimp? Yeah, it's working definitely. Look at that, you guys. We have a crimp. So you, you get the idea, right, you guys? You can crimp the hair. Isn't this awesome? How cool is that? You can crimp Barbie's hair. There's no wire attachment. 
it's just a bottle of water and this actually does work which I'm very very surprised and shocked now I did not go all the way down um and to remove this you just have to run a brush right through it and it comes right out of the, out of the Barbie dolls hair so you can crimp the hair look at that I think this is a pass for a change I think they just learn from their lessons they don't have the oily substance that the last doll did um the link is in the description for that first star review um they don't have an oily residue because i think they added water to this so it does work we're going to try to curl a section now and see if that works that would be a cool experiment let's see we're going to take this purple hair this purple hair looks cool right so we're going to take a purple hair piece right here and we're going to mist it right you want to lightly mist it all the way from top to bottom okay but you don't want it to be soaking wet. That's the main thing. You want it to be kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Cool. Okay, so this opens. It's got little spirals. I guess you put it right here, maybe. No hair expert whatsoever. Okay, you're going to pull this to the ends, right? Yeah. Hopefully you guys can see this. But um, So basically, you just want to wrap your sections up like this, right? Hopefully Barbie will have really pretty hair. Okay. So you're going to wrap this and you want to hold it for 15 seconds, just like that. And you could see like the crimp is still there, which is amazing because the last Barbie that I had, the um the curl dropped immediately. But I think this is going to be a pass. So this is definitely worked at $19 price. The fact that she does what she says, she does the crimp is still there after all this time. That's what I had a problem with the last one. The last one did not hold whatsoever. So we're going to see if this works for this Barbie doll right here. I think this is amazing, you guys. What do you guys think? Leave some comments down below. Let me know if you're going to be purchasing her. She's um, Barbie DIY Crimp and Curl. Crimp and Curl, as it was in the description. Um, so we're going to drop this curl and see if it actually curls the Barbie doll's hair, which I think is going to be amazing. I think it's going to be a pass, you guys. Let's see. I'm gonna just go like that. I don't know if it's tangled, but we're gonna see. Okay. And, yep, look at that. Curl. Bam. So it does work, you guys. I'm very, very surprised. Very nicely. You see that little body? It's like bam, just like that. Let's see if we can hold. Yeah, it seems to be not letting go. So we'll go and try another section and make sure that this curling iron works. I'm just so amazed at how everything works, you guys. We're going to curl another section. So again, you just want to take your little Barbie doll. You want to mist her hair down. I would not recommend um, shampoo or anything like that because I think they have a chemical in this doll's hair that helps it curl so try to keep it out of hot hot water um really cold icy water is recommended for this doll do not wash or gel or anything like that i think they have some type of curling mechanism in here so we're going to try this one right here i'm going to move it up this up the thing like that just like that it's so cool that you're able to curl bar hair and it's cool this is amazing um just make sure you use your mist and bottle it does not work without the uh, cold water in the misting bottle all the directions are included right here so if you don't know how to do anything ask your parents help um i'm sure your mom or your dad will help you try to curl barbie's hair they do come with little hair elastics so if you want you can like style it afterwards since it stays crimped you can see the crimpation is still there so you can definitely style the doll's hair afterwards if you choose to you can um crimp it and then you can crimp this whole doll's head and I guarantee it would stay because it's still there. Do you see that? The crimp is still there. That's amazing. Um, so we're going to let go of this curl. You're only supposed to hold it for like 15 seconds. Okay, let's see. I'm going to see. Hopefully it'll work. You think it will? Okay. I'm going to just kind of slide it out. That's all you got to do. Oh, that's pretty. You have a pretty curl. It, and it does work. Look at that, you guys. It's amazing. That's amazing. Do you see that? It's got definition. You see? It's like swoop. And it does work very well, you guys. You could see I'm barely even touching it because if it was 